I'm Tucker Gomberg on the Greenspiration Odyssey in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. Edmonton is a city of about 700,000 people. It's located on the banks of the North Saskatchewan River in the territory of Alberta where the buffalo used to roam. These days in Edmonton, it's not the buffalo that are roaming around, but hundreds of thousands of cars. Edmonton is known as the car commuter capital of Canada, and that causes all kinds of environmental and social problems. But there are alternatives. And interestingly, even though the temperature in Edmonton sometimes hits as low as 40 degrees below zero, and at that temperature, it doesn't matter if it's Fahrenheit or Celsius, it's darn cold. Here, more and more people are riding their bicycles to get around year-round. Now, how about when it gets really cold out? Is there anything in particular that you'd recommend for people considering riding? Well, dress is really the most important thing. I'm wearing two layers of wool mittens. I have a wool scarf on and a headband. I mean, really, it's just a matter of dressing for it. It's cheap and inexpensive. It keeps me healthy. I get exercise every day. It's guilt-free transportation, and it's a blast. It's fun slushing through the snow, and it's challenging, and I get to experience the elements on a daily basis all four seasons. Dan, you, you ride your bike uh, year-round, tell me why. I ride it year-round because I think a car is kind of a waste of money. Also, uh, it's good healthy exercise. People say, why do you ride your bike? And I say, well, it's just like cross-country skiing to work. So would you recommend it to other people? Well, of course, it's, uh, it's healthy transportation. It's a lot, it makes a lot more sense than driving your car to a health center and uh, riding a stationary bike, you might as well just ride your bike all the time. So. Great. Well, thanks a lot. Oh, you're welcome. Now, a lot of people um, would think that riding a bike when it's really icy and cold out would be dangerous. Do you find that it's dangerous riding in the wintertime? It's not generally that dangerous riding in the winter time. There's always a few days in, a, in the winter that it can get pretty hair raising. But overall, I think it's a big misconception that it's dangerous riding. Edmonton can be really cold in the winter and it's, it can be hard going, but I, I just have the right clothing and I get psyched up for it and I get into a groove and I can just do it for the winter. Well, Sally, you have me convinced. Let's go for a ride. I wouldn't tend to love my neighbor if I didn't think I should. I wouldn't suppose that you believe funny thing when the snow starts to fly or it gets really icy out many people think of going skating or going skiing well they might want to give a try to winter cycling it's never really too cold or too hot to ride your bike and it's always good for the planet I'm Tucker Gomberg on the Greenspiration Odyssey Tour in Edmonton Alberta Canada Your golden rock hurt to me, I wouldn't kiss your ass.